there's a couple reasons why today's video is special. Number one, it's Vlogmas, baby. Number two, we have a Starbucks to accompany us this morning. Number three, I got a damn mustache. <laughs> I know you can barely see it, but hey. Oh, wait, wait. You gotta get the right light. One second. Yeah! <laughs> you know it's Vlogmas when Teach has got a great little stash going on his lip. We are hooked up to the trailer right now, guys, and we are going up the ride industry to get this 350Z dyno, and we're gonna go a lot into that a little bit later, but we have a drive ahead of us. We're picking up Calvin, and most importantly, it's Vlogmas. So let's quickly go over what that really means this year. Okay, so in the past, we used to do daily uploads all the time. In the last about six to eight months, I've pretty much stopped that just because I couldn't handle it anymore. It takes a real beating out of you. As much as I love doing it, it was just really hard. So I've been taking a break. Vlogmas is supposed to be daily uploads up until Christmas. So that means from now, December 1st to December 25th, there's daily uploads. I'm gonna do my best to make that happen. I'm not making any promises, but I am saying, whenever you see this intro, it's Vlogmas. It's supposed to be special and it's going to be a lot more personal vlog style content over the next 25 days than just, hey, here are the builds, here's what you're seeing. Some days I might have an extremely clickbait title because I can't think of anything else to do. And you as the viewer have a major responsibility of one thing, no, of two, of almost three things. Help me out and just start off by giving this video a thumbs up right off the bat. Number two, it really helps out when you guys comment on the videos. You can comment anything, but just comment anything. And number three, sit back, relax, and enjoy the content, and I'll see you here every single day. And that's pretty much all I ask of you guys. That's really, that's really about it. Did you get Woo! Oh man, I would like to welcome you to vlog, miss. Oh man, welcome. You're doing it. We're, we're trying it. I just gave him a little brief rundown. Oh, so I was like, hey, well, what's the disclaimer? Like, if you guys see some some big clickbait, it's just because I ran out of ideas on what to do. So <laughs> I need you to know that from the start. That's number one. Oh, rule number two. Hey, Cal, do you notice anything a little bit different about me today? Mustache? Yeah! <laughs> <laughs> oh, no. Dude, I'm growing oh, no. I'm growing a big one. Don't it's do it. Starting out, it's starting out a little bit weak right now, and I should not, but hey, dude. She's here to stay. You can't just like bring out your thick mustache on Benedict. Like Ooh, that. I'm gonna I'm gonna kiss Serena today and tickle her at the same time. <laughs> Oh man, it is cold. What's well, off the show you guys if we get a view the mountain ranges like right next to us are like covered in snow And they're normally not I don't know if you can see my breath, but it's like 50s right now. We're like high 40s What's up? What's up brother? Time to make some planes. I know right? So I haven't really told you guys yet We're going somewhere pretty special with it with the 350z and the other day when we were supposed to go to a track event I noticed there was some stuff wrong with the car uh, It ended up just being that fuel filters and some of our pumps were kind of just failing out so it's had to be changed out, so it's good we got that fixed. We're actually, we're running to the dyno today to tune in some extra stuff that we're gonna be working on, which I know you guys love them. I title of the video, you probably can guess it by now. The thing looks really good. We're gonna have a really fun day today. It's always good when we have this car out in. The place where we're going with this, uh, later this week, we'll have so much driving time with this, so we kinda are just making sure everything on the car is 100% perfect, because I'm gonna be driving it more in the next like seven to 10 days than I ever have in any amount of time. So we just wanna make sure everything's 100% ready when we get there. and loaded, ready to go. The dyno is at Apexi, which is only 10 minutes away, so we'll see you guys at the dyno. So as we're on the 
Dino right now. Danny, our tuner unraveled. I'll, I'll plug him right here. And you guys are looking for tuning in Southern California. We are uh, looking for, I should say, Danny is just looking and double checking AFR, as he said. Because if you guys don't remember, the motor that's in this car is actually the spare motor. I blew my first motor and we're rebuilding it with Dan. So this is the spare motor and we were running the same tune on it. And it's running fine, but just because we had access to the Dino today and we had time, we're like, let's throw it on there, make sure it's all good. And at the same time, when I had it at Dan's, when he was checking for the fuel filters and all that type of stuff, he added in a pressure sensor into the clutch line. Now that is for a very specific reason. One of the things that I always love about Dan's car when he drives is he has that insane like backfire. I guess you would call it anti-lag, I guess, when he's off throttle. And I was like, Dan, I need that. Like, it's not even a question. And where this car is going in a week, I'm like, I need a little spice. So Dan said that in all of his Supras, he runs a pressure sensor in the clutch line. So whenever you are full throttle and then you go in on clutch and then it sees, you're better at explaining it than I am. Well, like Danny can set it up. So you have a 2000 PSI pressure sensor in line, like plumbed in line with your clutch, you know, down to your slave yeah. cylinder from your master cylinder. When the clutch is in, it senses it. He sets it up on the ECU to be like, okay, our criteria is clutch in, revving above six or above 65. Yeah. So you don't like clutch kick into yeah. every corner. And it'd be <laughs> yeah. like, bah, 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 bah. Wait, what? <laughs> but he'll set it up. I guess you'll probably tell him how to set it up and then you'll be flaming. So there's not going to be like a button or anything that I'm going to be pressing or anything. It's the idea is that it will happen naturally or organically as I'm driving. I'm not going to have to like drive and be like, oh, I need to press my hot start so it ignites. It's like, it's just going to like happen as we drive, which is completely badass. And is it necessary? No, it is completely unnecessary. Does not make any difference performance wise. Does it beat up the turbo? Yes, it does. But does it make me feel amazing and happy? Yes. Yes, it does. So that's why we're out here today. Calv, I don't know if you could notice, upcoming on December 6th, we have a complete new drop. December 6th, thehuntingcompany.com. I'm wearing one of the new sweatshirts right now. Look at that now. hat. And it's burgundy, and we have one of our new lids. We have three new hoodies. We have women's leggings, women crop tops, sweatshirts. We have new hats. We have new beanies. We have so much new stuff. The quality just went up. Hey, Cal, bank call. The stocks just went up. It's December 6th. Be ready for it. You're going to hear about it every single day until December 6th. We're five days out. I think we're gonna be launching it at 9 a.m. Pacific Standard Time. So keep your uh, keep your eyes up, boys. Too much time showing you guys just the pulls. He was adjusting AFRs and whatnot, making sure everything was solid. So we're all good on that aspect. Uh, we're gonna now start tuning for the two step. So it might take him a little bit. He might get it off the bat. If you guys don't remember, Danny tuned my super on the two step and he nailed it. This is a little bit different because it's all clutch actuated, pressure actuated. It's a little bit different. So we're not too sure how it's gonna react just yet, but this is definitely gonna be the highlight of today's video. I think we should, can we? <laughs> we have this pipe here. Oh. That's there to like control the exhaust and get it out of the way, but with water in the face right now. <laughs> we want to move it for the flames. I'll take the gas fumes to the face. I don't mind, baby. <laughs> this is where Danny's in there, like. Beep boop boop bop, beep boop, change things. Beep boop boop bop, beep boop bop. But I heard so it's like you don't have to reach over and touch a button or flip a switch. It's just like a sneaky hidden one built into your clutch. Bop, 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 bop. Bop. Is this one harder to set up than the Supra? No, easier. That's easier? Yeah. Okay. It's not as loud as the Supra yet. No. Well, I don't think I'm going to get it that loud. Okay. Yeah, the Supra is different. Why is, that, why, why is that one louder than this one? I think it's your head work. Okay. Yeah. Oh, shit. Okay. Yeah, this is stock. And is the, other, the Supra's not VVTi, is it? No. Uh, no. The, the other Supra one's not VVTi. It's not VVTi. This is, this VVTi. is VVTi, yeah. yeah. So it's a bit different. Okay. Yeah. Yeah, it's slowly getting better at the back. Okay. So much more aggressive. Oh, oh my god. Yo, what did you just do different? 
made it more aggressive. Dude, I was right by, like the last, wow, yeah. big difference. <laughs> I, that was way different. <laughs> oh, wow. Dude, I didn't even know it was gonna happen. I was sitting in the trailer and I kind of like shit myself. So negative three and a half degrees, comes back, bumps it, holds it right around there. Yeah, it looks like it, okay. A little bit. The last one you did before that was so weak. Yeah. And then that one was just like, Yeet. That's exactly how you need it. Just gun fire. Oh, dude. My ears are ringing. Let's see how much boost we get out of this one. Steps working. What we gotta do now is we gotta go in, start a PC log. Let's set up the dyno, do another, do another pull. <laughs> okay, all right, so let's go ahead and stop the PC, save data log before continuing. No, let's go ahead and shut it off. DJ! Yeah? You made 601 at 65. <laughs> what? Sorry. <laughs> hey, look at that. Ah. So it works now, Danny? Uh, yeah, um, right there, my trial runs were at 4,000, just so I don't rev it really stupidly high. Yeah. But, um, so technically what how the AM works is you have to retard timing out of your timing table. So if you're at 25 degrees where you want two-step to kick in, I need to reduce more than 25 degrees to get the turbo to spool. So I need to figure out what number that is. That's why I just did this pull because I need to figure out. So at 4,000, I know I need to pull out almost 28 degrees and to get it to crazy bang, bang, booms, yeah. you know? Um, but I was like slowly getting into it until it finally started banging really loud. And I was like, oh, I found that sweet number. So now I need to do that to 6,000, but I kind of know what the sweet number is. Mm. So now I can dial it in. And then it's going to be really cool too. It's going to be really rowdy because if you're above, if you're above 6,000 and you're done with the run and you clutch in, your two-step and your anti-lag is activated. So on D cell, you're just gonna be like boom, 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 crazy. In. Yeah. yeah, yeah. So Which after not happen unless he makes it happen. exactly. Which so I'll learn to do. Yeah. After after <laughs> this run, after I did this run, I clutched in and you heard a backfire. Yeah, yeah. That yeah, was yeah. the two-step. <laughs> That because it was wow. under, yeah. All right, we're all packed up, ready to go home. And for those who watched our trailer video, holding up nicely. It's looking beautiful. There was some little. Totally there was a little it. concern of how it would hold up with the flooring. Oh, no, Flooring's good. great. She's good. She's already dirty, but you know. But you know. It's she's good. She's good. She's good. She's, she's real good. We just got back. The car is on the lift, and tomorrow we're gonna come back. We're gonna have to adjust some stuff and get it ready before we leave. But I do want to say for everyone who did order something for Black Friday, thank you. We appreciate it. By the time you guys are watching this video, I believe it will be Monday. And by Monday, we should have all the Black Friday orders out. So if we did purchase something, it will be shipped out on our end. So if you live in the United States, you'll get it in a couple days. And if you live international, it takes a little bit longer. Also, this hat comes in black with red, and then we also have it in like a navy blue. We've never done a navy blue hat before, ever. When we finally have one. I normally don't like blue hats just because when they're blue, you can't wear it with that many things. I feel like it clashes so much, but this is actually a new color that's a little bit darker than the typical blues that you've seen. So it's almost like super, super dark navy. So it's not quite black, but it's not really like blue. And it passes off a lot better in my opinion. So you can wear it more like every day and not have a hat that looks like it's like sticking out like a torso. I'm like, this hat is perfect with this blue shirt. This is a perfect combo. And then we have a patch design for another black hat that we are running this design on our windbreakers that we're doing, which I'm sure you guys will see sometime soon, but. 
I'm being told it's a bomber windbreaker. Bomber. It's a wind. It's a bomber. It's, it's a bomber. Not a windbreaker. It's a bomber windbreaker. Wind bomber, wind bomber. It's not a windbreaker, guys. It's a bomber windbreaker jacket. And because now it's freezing across the world, we have two beanies. We have a gray beanie with the same patch designs, and then we have a black beanie with the red and the black. Stay warm this Christmas. <sighs> Alright guys, I have some really bad news. This uh, was definitely something that I wasn't hoping to have to say, but no one commented on my mustache today. No one even fucking realized <laughs> that I was growing a damn mustache. Sabrina, I told you I was doing a mustache. I would come in there, Sabrina, but there's no light, so... I can't film in there. It's gonna, it's gonna take, it's gonna take a couple days of grooming. Just a couple. <laughs> it's, it's gonna take a bit. It's gonna take a bit. Day one of Vlogmas is here. Try to remember to come back tomorrow because we're gonna have another video every single day. Me and you, baby. Wait. We're gonna get to and know each other a lot better in the importantly, next couple of weeks. Most importantly, tell them that now that it's December, it's officially my birthday month. Sabrina's birthday is on the 21st. Woo! You can add yeah! her on Venmo and send her donations. <laughs> I'm kidding. Thank you guys for watching. I appreciate it. Peace out. And keep moving forward. <laughs>